Hello there, I'm Farmer Brad, and on today's video, I'm going to get my bed prepped for cover crop. Now, this front garden, I tried to plant some stuff in, it didn't go so well, so for the last two weeks, I've been tarping it, and then what I'm gonna do is do a comparison of several cover crops. Recently, I was sent a homestead box, and the theme of the box this month was cover crops. They sent me hairy vetch, beech or something, tillage radish, winter pea, and crimson clover coated. I'm gonna see how this is underneath. Without further ado, let's get to this. this doesn't look too bad I think the cover crop will get a good head start the next step is getting the beds measured and what I'm going to do is three foot beds with one foot paths and that way the paths will just get compacted and the beds will be good so as I'm making the paths I'll do one scoop to the right, one scoop to the left, one scoop to the right, and so forth. And that will hopefully give me uh, some dirt to work with uh, on the top. So some of the tools that will be helpful are an edger, a flat shovel, a piece of rebarb or a stake, and some rope. I have one of these fancy dancy rulers that also works as a yardstick, so this is what I'll be using to do my measurements. Now I'm gonna continue to even this out and get rid of some of the grass. This is a, I don't know, a different type of hoe, and then this is sort of like a rake. That should work well to even things out.
Now I would like to mention that the fine folks over at the Homestead box, in the latest box they sent me, has this uh, DRAM fan shaped uh, water sprinkler. Let's see what type of spray this gives off. Oh, that's, that's nice. This, this will work perfect for this. So what I'm gonna do is get the, gra uh, the dirt all saturated. I won't get this extra dirt wet over here and that's what I'll sprinkle it back on after I've sowed the seed. is crimson clover and it's uh, the coated variety. I'm gonna try to see how this hand uh, sprayer does. If not, I'll just hand, hand toss it. And it says that each bag will do about a thousand square feet. So let's see how this does. So this one will do a thousand square feet. So I hope you've enjoyed seeing how I've prepped these beds and I'll be updating via Facebook and Instagram the progress 
of each of these beds as the cover crop comes up. Now, the rest of it, I have a lot more of uh, oats with radish in it, and I'll probably just do that the rest of it just because I have enough for that area. So, this is my first time at doing cover crops, so I'm not a cover crop expert, but I would like to thank the Homestead Box for supplying the tools needed uh, in, in their box, the cover crop seeds, the four varieties, and the garden hose sprayer, as well as a few other items that I haven't utilized yet, but I do plan on using them in an upcoming video. So thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Every little bit helps. Until next time.